I'm a caretaker on Seguin Island, Mariah's Logs, written by New Unknowns. Greetings. I write this in hopes that after giving you the required time, as per our agreement, that I will be allowed to return to my life back home. I resent you and what you are for and what you've done to me. I am bound to you no longer after tomorrow morning. I trust you respect our deal and find someone else to do your dirty work. You've been in existence since the beginning of time, so you say. With that being said, I'm sure that you must respect some form of tradition. You must have some integrity when playing your own games. I gave you ten years. Ten long, terrifying years of wondering if this visit would kill me. Will the fog scoop me up and take me to hell? Will I have to burn in the flames for all eternity after all? The cancer was eating me alive from inside out. I could feel my flesh dying. I spoke to so many doctors that I lost count, and they all had no answers for me. They all told me that there was nothing that could be done to save my life, except for you. You came to me that night beside my hospital bed, salivating at the bargaining chip that you had in your hand. You even came in a white coat. You really love to play that role. I still appreciate that you have given me this second chance at life, but I have paid the price for it. I've fed too many people to this evil. I am responsible for 18 lives given up to your demons. I've done my part. Let me go. I'll follow the protocol. This way I know that there's no way you can say that I breached the contract. Even though it makes me sick writing this, I will go through the formality of describing the current caretaker in my log. I can't wait to not be your puppet anymore. The current caretaker under my watch seems to have a fitting mindset for the job. Rest assured, I will do all that is in my power to convince him that if he follows the rules, he will be fine. Your island will be tended to, as it always is. From what I gather, he's lived many lives already and his soul will be quite the meal. He comes off tough and rugged, but I know that his heart has a lot to offer. It's in there somewhere, the purity. He hides it with his exterior. He must have been wronged many times in the past. You'll love him, I'm sure. But there's a whole lot of me that hopes that he survives. I'm not afraid to tell you this because you're in my mind even now. You're always listening. I hope that he gets away and exposes the island for what it is, and it burns to ash. Then it'll look a lot more like home for you. Signing off and good riddance, Mariah L.